Good morning, Internet. What's up? <laughs> Sitting in my office right now, joined by actually uh, that little girl right there. Who's feeling better? Somewhat better. Much better than last night. Um, but I am currently making uh, a balloon delivery right now. This is the delivery as they requested it, which is a birthday cake. I think it came out pretty nice. I like it. I feel like it needs something else. So I thought I would quickly assemble this. To add to it. Anybody know what this is? I'll show you. Elmo kind of holding and hanging on to the cake. He needs some eyes though. Baby, can you run upstairs and get me a Sharpie? Sure. Thank you. Love that little girl. I don't know. Congrats what the wife thinks. Cake only or add the Elmo? So the wife thinks that the Elmo might be a little bit too kiddish because it is for a husband. Um, so an older gentleman. Uh, is getting it so that Elmo might seem a little too young. So we're gonna lose the Elmo and do some more candles on it. And when it comes to balloon stuff, my wife is typically uh, right about how she thinks, oh no, I need to get some more balloons out of the car first though. All right, uh, actually, you know what? I should grab my big pump too. And then where are my other balloons? There we go. I own way too much balloon stuff. For example, when it comes to balloons, I have a tremendous amount of them and I just never seem to have the right ones. Like I was just looking for a balloon so I had to rip apart my balloon bags and I have about four of these filled with over, I would say like 8,000 balloons. Um, each bag of these has a different color in them. Um, so one of them is all specialty balloons. One of them is all uh, earth tones, black, whites, browns, that kind of stuff. Um, another one is all the reds, orange, yellows, greens, and the next one is all the blues, indigos, and violets. But I don't bring those to my actual uh, events with me. I bring one of these two bags. This is my large bag that is all set up, I and each, all the balloons are nozzled up, so you can just grab a balloon, pull it out just like that, and use it, and you know which color you're grabbing, because again, they're all the same way here. Um, you have all your earth tones, and then you have Roy G. Biv. <laughs> and Roy G. Bib, but the bigger balloons, Roy G. Bib, the smaller balloons here. Um, and then I have the same setup, but in an apron form with the uh, twist them up right here. And uh, kind of the same idea. We have all the earth tones up top, and then it goes, starts here, goes Roy G. Bib, and then the same thing with uh, larger balloons on this side. And then all the specialty balloons are in these uh, front pocket things here. So anyway, um, yeah, that's how uh, balloons are at my house. We also have large pumps like this. I have about three of those uh, in helium tank just in case. Uh, all serve a different purpose because when I'm doing uh, large events, many, many hours of balloons, I use this bag. When I had to fly down to Florida and do balloons for McDonald's, uh, I brought this bag with me and just one of those little hand pump things. In fact, I have it over here because I just threw it down the stairs. One of these pumps. Uh, like that to blow up balloons. Juggling clubs, I've had the same set of clubs for, you know, 10 years now. Um, and every once in a while I buy a new set just for practice, but the set that I perform with, I just retape and uh, I like the weight, I like the style of them. And during my performances, I don't break them at all. It's the balloons that I constantly am buying more and more of. It's probably the biggest overhead that I've ever had with the business. All right, let me get this delivery out. For a Ken? That's me. Hi. How are you? I guess it's your birthday. It is. There you go, sir. Wow. Happy birthday to you. Boy colors. Thank you, Sam. Right, I appreciate it. No problem. Thank you. So Matthew asked me um, if I got anything cool, gadgety for Christmas, and I really didn't. Other than the light-up shoes, those are awesome. But uh, any new cameras, any new stuff like that? No, no new equipment. Except I, I did get this. Uh, the lens shield thing here um, on the front of this camera uh, and this lens. And it is really big uh, when you look at it, um, but uh, you know, it makes
makes it makes it look even wider. <laughs> um, but yeah, that, that's about it. That's all I got. Kids are still feeling pretty cruddy today. Um, no more throwing up, which is awesome. Uh, but they are still running a fever and kind of just taking it easy. Lots and lots of Pediasure ice pops going around. I myself am starting to feel lousy, but I think it's, uh, what do you call that? When, when you, someone's sick around you, so you just think that you're gonna get it, so you almost force it and will it upon yourself. Uh, um, I am uh, trying to think like that's what it is, but who knows the difference between if I'm willing it on myself or literally I'm just starting to feel bad. But I'm hoping this is the same virus that I had three, four days ago that they're just getting now um, and I won't get it again. My wife, on the other hand, has not been sick yet at all, so I'm just waiting for that to happen. Uh, and that's rough. And I hope that the kids, though, are better before my wife gets it. Uh, because if I have to take care of my wife's puke and my kids' puke, uh, and maybe my own puke, it's not going to be a good day.